Hello, my earth sign friends, and welcome to your daily love outlook for May 23rd, 2018. Oops, this is for earth signs, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. We'll do Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn in that order, please. Spirit angels, what messages do you have for our earth signs for Wednesday the 23rd? What do they need to know? One card for Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. Whoa. Not half the deck. <laughs> My goodness. There we go. And for our cappies. Okay, so we have Taurus. You guys are, are confused on what direction to go. You're tired of putting up a fight. You're tired of battling for a relationship that, that the other person does not want, or this could be vice versa. But um, you or your partner is not seeing something that's right in front of you. For Virgo, you guys are going to be offering um, either getting a job offer or you're going to be offering your time, your investment into, um, could be a fire sign who um, is letting their guard down, letting their wall down. Capricorn, you are dealing with a strong, dominant male in your life. Um, could be Aries, but uh, yeah, you are giving up the fight as far as, for me, I'm seeing this as more like a father figure. Why is it two wands here in reverse for Taurus? But your guys' bottom of the deck is the Ten of Cups in reverse, so unhappy um, relationships. Oh, Taurus. Okay, so um, Taurus, you guys have the moon. There's secrets going on. There's things going on behind the scenes, behind your back um, with your partner, or this could be you, could be vice versa, but somebody is bored in the relationship, and they're no longer uh, putting up a fight to keep it, and yeah, Taurus, I see either you're leaving your partner or your partner is leaving you due to secrets. Virgo, uh, you are being led to, uh, to follow your intuition. Also, you're keeping secrets as well. If you were a Virgo coupled with a Taurus, you guys are keeping secrets, um, from either one or the other. Um, and I see the Virgo walking away to a more spiritual relationship, to a more spiritual path. Spirit saying to trust your instincts and move forward as you feel um, you're guided to because you, you're getting a, a gift from the universe but you're not seeing it just yet because you're still um, stuck in this ten of cups in reverse Capricorn you are getting a second chance with a fire sign uh, male Aries or just a fire sign in general but you guys are getting a second go at this um, yeah you will be successful this time because before the person that you were trying to uh, manifest a relationship with was not ready. They were not stable. Um, they were not prepared to uh, give you a relationship. Your bottom of your angel deck is unrequited love. So for especially Virgo and uh, Taurus, I'm seeing that, that there isn't the shared love going back and forth um, you have children and love yourself first so children may be affecting your love life and make sure you um, are investing in yourself before you invest in too many people I'm going to see if I can get another group of you guys here 
Spirit and Angels, what messages do you have for our Earth sign, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for Wednesday, the 23rd of May? First card, Taurus. Second card, Virgo. Third card, Capricorn. Bottom of the deck situation. Okay. So for the, this group of you, Taurus, you guys have a, um, a choice to make, a decision um, on whether to... Uh, give somebody another chance or you're picking between two people um, and this person is your complete opposite so you are wondering if it's going to work but it will just trust your intuition follow your heart and uh, oh, and you're going to be led in the right direction you're being spiritually guided to move forward um, and you will uh you will be guided on which person, which path to take. That's Capricorn. Oops. Virgos, you guys have these seven of swords. You're sneaking around. You're sneaking around on somebody or somebody's sneaking around on you. You are... Or Capricorn. Um, yeah, you're sneaking off in the night. Um, I will clarify that further. Okay. Oh, I don't know. I just pulled three there, but okay. Um, yeah, Virgo or Taurus, you guys are, um, making a choice on whether to stay or go. There's heartbreak. You're mourning the loss of this relationship and, uh, you have battled as hard as you can for it. And it's just, you're about at your your um as much as you can stand or the person that you're dealing with so you your choice is whether to stay or go there could be a fire sign female that is um standing in the way of this decision or you are leaving the fire sign female for virgos the truth is coming out you have the ace of swords with the seven of swords the truth's going to come out and it's going to cause heartbreak um of somebody involved because you're going to walk away because this is no longer satisfying you. Um, gosh, I'm getting a heavy Taurus um, vibe with this one as well. But there is a lot of heartbreak here. And instead of sneaking off, you're going to come forward with the truth. Capricorns, you guys are going to follow your heart. You're going to give your cup to somebody. You guys are no longer allowing the internal conflict to stop you. Um, even though you've been hurt in the past, you are getting over this state of mourning. You are ready to take those two of cups and move forward. Um, you no longer feel like you have to fight for this um, because they are putting just as much effort into it as you are. What advice do you have for our earth signs? Yeah, um, allow those, those inner conflicts within yourself to... It's like you're talking yourself out of it. And... Um, just have the faith and and you'll be able to move forward um, successfully and offer your cup to someone who's going to receive it with open arms. For a group of you, you are healing family issues. Your love life benefits when you forgive your parents. And not just your parents, but um, you know, your, your anybody in your family, your siblings, your aunts, your uncles, your grandparents. Um, all of those family issues need healed before you can truly love in a um, in a way where you're not guarded or or um, or not giving it your all. So that's what I have for you guys, Earth signs. Um, I hope you guys have a beautiful Wednesday and good luck. I'll see you next time.